Goalkeeper Trainer is the application created for the goalkeeper's coaches, allowing you to manage, organize and store the goalkeeper's data and performance during trainings and matches. All the sections of the application are accessible from the main menu. Goalkeepers, games, exercises, trainings, tests, maximals, goals, prints and configuration. In each of these sections, you can see a list of all the elements previously inserted. Different operations are available thanks to the buttons situated up in the right corner of a window. Print, search, show all, sort and close to exit the section. However, they are present on each window and may vary according to the one you choose. If you click on the plus icon, up on the right or the left side, according to the window, a new item is created. If you click on the trash icon on the right side, it is deleted. Otherwise, if you click on the icon on the left side of the item, you can see all the details related and you can enter or change data. Anyway, if you position the mouse over any icon or button of the application, the help message appears. Goalkeeper Trainer allows you to include drawings, photos, audio contents and video clips too, choosing the appropriate button and selecting the corresponding file. While other multimedia items are stored within the application, it doesn't store the video clips, but only the path within the device, because of their excessive dimensions that could slow down the application's functioning. This is why it is very important Never to change the name and the location of a video clip on your device. If you click on the play icon, you can start playing the video. In general, when you open the main page of any section of this application, the title appears at the top of the section and below there is the number of items currently displayed. If they are underscored, it means there are elements not displayed. If you want to see them, press the Show All button on the right side. You can also search elements if you click on the Search button. Enter the search criteria in one or more fields where the symbol of lens appears and then press the Enter key on your keyboard. To move between the items, press the arrow buttons situated on the right top side of the tab. The goalkeepers list contains all the information regarding a single goalkeeper, accessible from the details icon on the left side of the goalkeeper you've selected. The data are organized in thematic cards, personal data, evaluations, measurements, workouts, tests, injuries, matches and multimedia. In the personal data tab, there's a possibility to enter the goalkeeper's personal data, those related to family, school or work previous seasons and also customize questionnaires regarding the psychophysical state of the goalkeeper. Questions on personal, technical and psychological aspects and expectations of the goalkeeper too. It is also possible to insert the photo of the goalkeeper or to delete it. In the previous season tab, if you select the details icon on the left side of the element, you can insert all the information of that season. Choosing the plus button on the right side of the season box, you can define the new season. Choosing the one near to the category box, you can define the new category, specifying its detailed information. In the Personal, Technical, Psychological and Expectations Questions tabs, part the data contained in the questionnaire, it is possible to enter the data regarding the season, author, the date of the survey and notes. Pressing the Show Data button, you can access to a detailed view of questions and answers. The questions are offered in a list that can be modified in the Configuration and Goalkeeper section. In these and other tabs, selecting the box on the top left side, you can see only the elements of the default season, which is usually set to the current one. The default season can be set in the Configuration and Seasons section. The Evaluation tab includes Synthetical, Tactical, Technical, Psychological, Conditional and Coordinational Evaluation tabs of the Goalkeeper. 
In each of them, it's possible to eventually view only the default season's data and insert information about the item selected. The parameters of the evaluations are proposed in a list that can be modified in the Configuration section Goalkeeper tab. In the Measurements tab, you can insert or view all the results of the anthropometric measurements and maximals of the exercises performed with both or only one limb. It is also possible to view only the default season data, while from the detail icon you can access to a tab for data entry. This tab contains the graphs showing the anthropometric measurements trend in a period of time. The workouts tab contains information regarding the training seasons organized in micro, meso and macro cycle and single session. As usual, the checkbox for limiting the data displaying only on the default season. The data entered are represented in a graphical way too, so if you click on the graph icon, the mark and weight graphs appear. Below the first graph, there are other ones containing information on how long the goalkeeper participated to trainings for each conditional, coordinative and technical element. In the Periodization tab, there is a possibility to establish the goals of the period of training. If you click on the Details icon, you can see all the information and insert video clips. The Tests and Injuries tabs show the detailed information about tests and injuries respectively, while the Matches tab contains the list of matches played with some of the synthetic data and graphs, displaying the trend of evaluations in a period of time. The Multimedia tab displays the video clips of matches, trainings and periodizations eventually inserted for the goalkeeper concerned. The Matches List section contains data regarding matches, divided in general information, technical, tactical, psychological, other evaluations, situations, actions and goals conceded. On the first tab, in addition to general information on the match, you can insert a video clip and indicate the proper formation and those of the opponent, including reserves. Furthermore, it is possible to enter the names of your team players every time or to load the default ones defined in the configuration section Teams tab. You can also store the data related to the referees, linemen, replacements and scorers. The next tabs contain on their left side the list of the goalkeepers participating the match and on their right side the regarding information. First, it is necessary to choose the goalkeeper you want to insert data for by clicking on its tab, which will appear highlighted by white color. Then you continue with data entering on the right side of the tab. You can choose any of the options from the list that appears and write a comment nearby. You can edit these options in the Configuration section Matches tab. In addition, each goalkeeper's tab contains graphs showing the action and goal statistics. If you click on the action icon, the matches graph and situations and actions statistics appear. If you choose the buttons on the right side, you can see the situations graphs as well as those of defensive and offensive actions. Returning to the goalkeepers tab, if you click on the goal icon, drawings and graphs regarding the goal scouting appear. If you choose the buttons on the right side, you can see the graphs regarding goals type and mode. The last tab of the section contains a list of goals conceded. For each goalkeeper, it is possible to sign graphically the position of the ball, of the goalkeeper and that of the marker at the very moment of the score. You can insert a drawing, a photo, an audio comment and a video clip. The Goal List section displays information regarding the goals conceded by each goalkeeper. 
There are models provided by the application to indicate the balls, the goalkeepers and the markers position and you can insert drawings, photos, audio and video clips too. In addition, there are also matches and goalkeepers tabs where you can consult a brief overview of some relevant information. If you click on the details icon, the respective tabs with detailed information appear, with possibility to insert or edit any of them. In the training program section, you can plan the exercises, trainings, macro, meso and microcycles and single training sessions. In the exercises list, it is possible to create and display exercises. On the www.gktrainer.com site, you can download a package of free exercises, as well as that on payment, in order to enrich your own collection. From the details icon, you can access to a single exercise tab, where you can insert the drawings and video clips, while the materials, technical, conditional and coordinative elements are to be selected among those proposed by the respective lists. The lists can be modified in the Configuration section, Workouts tab. Inside the Training list, you can create specific trainings combining different exercises. The Details icon, you can access to the Training tab, where you can select exercises you want to combine, their order and video clips related. The exact quantity of materials necessary for the training is calculated by the application at the moment you click on the update button nearby. So whenever you make changes to the exercises list, you have to update the materials list. The macro, meso, microcycles and sessions list describe how the trainings were planned. In fact, you can program a single training session by grouping them into the weekly microcycles, monthly mesocycles and several months cycles, macro cycles. Thus, the dates of the beginning and the ending of each cycle or session have to be within the cycle they belong. Each session is assigned to a certain training built earlier. It is also possible to have a graphical view of the time employed during the training sessions for the conditional, coordinative and technical elements. Unlike the graphs contained in the goalkeeper's session, referring to the time the goalkeeper selected participated to each component of the training, the data shown here are related to how much time a certain session or cycle dedicates to each component of training. In addition, you can enable the filter to see only the data of a single cycle of training, which will be highlighted with a yellow background, while the filtered items appear on its right side or below the selected element. The test list displays some of the tests the goalkeeper could perform in order to evaluate his physical performance such as strength, reactivity, explosiveness, etc. Apart from these, the coach can also insert his own specific tests, accessing the related tab from the details icon. You can insert a detailed description of the test, up to three photos, and indicate whether the test should be done by one or both limbs. The Maximals list displays exercises helping you to evaluate the athlete's muscle strength. As usually, there is always the possibility to enrich the collection by creating your own, selecting the plus button. From the details icon on the left side of the item, you can enter the tab containing all the relative information, such as the description of exercise, the muscle group involved, if it can be done by both or only one limb, and its picture or drawing. The printable layout section shows on the left side the buttons displaying the blank layouts regarding the matches scouting 
for all the measurable data or separately for goals, actions, situations and evaluations. On the right side you can access the layouts optimized for printing. In the configuration section you can enter the data displayed in the lists contained in the other sections of the application. You can select the language of the application and selecting the dictionary configuration button you can also change the terms used in the application in order to adopt them better to your needs. The main page of the section contains tabs and buttons. You can use the tabs at the top of the page to insert questions and evaluations regarding the goalkeepers, information necessary to compose exercises and workouts, matches evaluations, situations and actions, goal type and mode. If you click on the buttons situated on the left side of the page, you can access the configuration of coaches, seasons, work groups, competitions, teams, categories and authors. There are also buttons for password and license changing exercises import, data import export and reset.